Hello guys, my name is Kautun and I'm going to take you into a tutorial on how to convert an AutoCAD file, a GWG file, into a GIS shape file and doing the vice versa, uh, converting a GIS file into AutoCAD. So this is our file that we have a mine plan uh, tutorial, that's the plan that, I plan, the plan that we have. So I already pre-opened our AutoCAD and our ArcMap, I'm using ArcMap uh, 10.5 and AutoCAD 2017 so this is our plan it hasn't been finished yet this is our plan in AutoCAD so this is what we are having the crashing and everything as you can see the plan so I will minimize this then I will go straight to ArcMap so when you are converting it's for, for this tutorial we are using ArcMap to convert uh, to an AutoCAD file to ArcMap and doing it vice versa so what you do you first connect your you go to catalog then you go to folder connection you connect to a folder in this case our folder is already connected the one that you want to use this is the just the tutorial which was on the desktop so after connecting your folder you then drag uh the, the plan that you the gwg file to acme then you say okay then you go to layers then you select the code in your system, you go to properties, you could select the code in your system that you want to use. This is already on our uh, favorites. So you yes, just say apply and OK. So as you can see here, it's now in meters. So from there, you go again to, if you can see, here you say main tutorial DWG annotations, we have point, we have polyline, we have polygon and uh, multi pages so right now we want to convert we want to export uh, uh the naming and everything it doesn't matter right now what you want is uh, those lines so we sell we mark and uh, we go to where there is a tick in the box and uh, we untick and tick and see which one is the one that you want so this one is for annotation this one is for points we don't need these ones and this one yeah, this one is the one that you need. It's written polyline. So you go to the one that you need and right click on it. Then go to data, then say export. When you go to data export, it will give you a folder like this. Then you select the output folder that you want uh, the information to be on. So let me go and select the one that I want it to be. When I want it to be in tutorial. So output name. I can write a uh, uh, sorry card to GIS. So it's we are connecting this one from AutoCAD to GIS. Then you select uh you go here, save as type, you want it to as a shape file, then it will already go will put the, the shape file extension, then you say save. Then you say okay. Now it's converting. Uh, do you want it uh, export data? Yes. Then from there, as you can see, we can have it here. So now I can remove this one, then remove this. Then we are left with something like this. That's how you convert it to a, to a GIS file. Now yeah, what you have to do is just to save this. Save. Uh, I want to save it in tutorial. Then I say again a card to GIS. Then save. So that's how you save it. If you want to check if it's saved, you can go here. As you can see in our tutorial again, all the tutorial now it's saved. This is the what you wanted to do. Then from there what you can do also you can do what we have done vice versa you want to save it again as a card uh for from gis to card we have this one it's a gis file this is how it looks like so you go to a gis file then you right click then go to convert now we want to convert it export it to card you go to that data it should take a while then you have to wait for it so that it can convert 
sorry my laptop is a bit slow but hopefully yes it is loaded so you select we want this one into a hard file so it will say select the folder that you want to work in what i usually do i select this one then i say save it will tell me that there is an error because this one is already there now i'll just get to edit here then to uh, follow the whole path then i come here then i'll write the name that i want it to be so now it's gis to cut as it is then you just say okay instead of following the whole path it will go like this you wait for some few minutes then ah uh, sorry some few seconds it should be done it will pop up here there we go it's not loading here we go so i can close this one I no longer need to yes yes it is now exported to autocad it retains the same colors that it had before as you can see it's now an autocad file written gis to cut we can minimize here or we can even close here let me close from now it's done it is exported then close my GIS. Then I go to AutoCAD. Next one. So you go to Startup. You go into Files. Okay, here it is. GIS to AutoCAD. You can now open it. It's now in AutoCAD. PWG. Ah, that's it, guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. If you have questions and other things you can uh, help me to update this, please leave something in the comments. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe so that you can continue making other videos like this. Uh, goodbye, guys.